welcome to vlogmas day seven <laughs> so i had a bit of a wanted to get on with things quick morning i literally had my breakfast at the um like desk while i was editing which i'm sure you'll have seen and then i've come straight into here and got myself ready i still need to do my hair and my lipstick but i need to quickly pop out to the post office because um i've got some more bracelet orders to go out i've got a really itchy back and then when I come back, I'm going to be recording today. Um, so I don't want it to be boring. So when we go out, we are going to go to a Home Bargains and have a look at some of the Disney stuff that they've got out and the Christmas stuff. And I need I need some toilet roll because we've run out of toilet roll. And I need to get some more things for the Christmas table. Um, if you'll have watched a few days ago, I got some Santa like covers for some chairs. But I need to get some more because Matthew's parents were pretty sure are coming around for Christmas dinner. So uh, we're renting a table and chairs so that there's like room for everyone and we're like turning downstairs into like a dining room for Christmas. So yeah, I need to get some more Santa table covers. Um, the table runner, I just wanna get it all before it sells out. Um, so we're gonna go to the post office, we're gonna have a look around Home Bargains. I'll try and record the best I can. Surprisingly, even though it's just a local one, that Home Bargains is always really busy and it is my local one as well. So I'll try my best. And then when we get back, we're gonna record, or at least that's the plan. I want it at least get those three done and then I can do like the DIY wreath one another day and um, I don't really know I've got a lot I want to get on with and I'm trying to be as quick as possible today so I got the vlog up a little bit earlier than I normally do I mean it's still going up at six o'clock for you guys but yeah I'm just trying to hurry up I've got myself ready and yeah I'm gonna get my clothes on and quickly pack up some bracelet orders and then we'll go out to the post office and to the shops so I've packed up all my bracelet orders and just before I head out to the post office I thought we'd just quickly open my calendar I know we could do it when I get back because we're not gonna be very long but I don't know if it's one of my little chocolates I'm gonna have it like right now but if it's like my big one I'll have it when I get back with a cup of tea like while I film so let's just have a look and see what it is. So it's a big one. So I'm hoping it's a big one. <gasps> yes, it's a big one. Okay, awesome. I kind of really want it now because I'm hungry, but I'm gonna put it here and we'll have it with a cup of tea when we get back and we're gonna go to the post office and we're gonna go to the shops. <laughs> home bargains um i don't think i did what to record and i'm really sorry there wasn't a lot to show to be honest hang on yeah there wasn't a lot in there um why does the camera keep changing the light i hope it's okay there we go the camera keeps changing the light hang on i'm gonna put a different light on that might be better <sighs> right is that a bit better I don't know anyway yeah so there wasn't very much in home bargains to be honest like to record and i went in for the santa well i'll show you it's gone the light keeps changing Urgh. so i went in for these which are like covers for chairs and um, i need another two packs of these and i didn't have any left so i'm a bit worried so i need to go to a different one very soon because they're obviously starting to sell out so while i was in there um i decided against getting the santa leg covers so it's like santa's leg like on the table legs if that makes sense i just don't know if they looked a little bit cheap um i don't know if it comes to before christmas and they're still there i might get them but i'm going to spend my money on other things in the meantime but i'll show you what i did get so i got some toilet roll that's fun hello mr bun what are you doing you coming to see what i've been buying well i'm sorry i didn't get anything for you hang on let me I'm just going to put some salad out for the bun. Also, I have no idea what is wrong with this camera. I'm going to have to put it somewhere else, I think. Now it's just really bright. I don't know what's wrong with the camera. I'm going to have to put it on a different angle, I think. Hang on. Also, the bun is flattening my stuff. What are you doing? What are you doing? So if I try and put it there, is that going to work instead? No. When it looks at my face, it just decides to change lighting. I'm not really sure. Right, I'm just going to give the bun some um, veg and then I'll show you what I actually bought. Oh, bun! It's all over your face! You absolute numpty. Get that off your face. 
We've got this stuff that we get the bun from Home Bargains. It's called like salad stuff. You can get it in like Wilkinson and stuff as well. And he's absolutely obsessed with it. And he's so obsessed when you go give him it, he doesn't move. He's just like, give me it, give me it. So I've just poured it all over his head. So that was fun. Okay, so I'm pretty sure that I'm having Matthew's parents over for Christmas dinner and his sister and I think his brother. Um, so I wanted to get, I wanted to get the Santa belt table runner from Home Bargains. But when I was looking, I was like, is it a little bit cheap looking? Like I'm all for a bit of cheesy traditional Christmas, but they had a whole new range of table like placemats and sets and things. And I was like, hmm, I could buy like a whole set and make it look quite nice. So there was three colors and two designs in each color. So I went for red and gold and I went for reindeers because there was like damask or there was silver, gold or red. And then like both patterns was in both colors. So I went for the reindeers. So I got a gold table cover um, with little reindeers all on it. I don't know how well it's gonna come up on camera, but it's really sparkly. Like it's actually really nice. It's not coming up on camera very well at all, is it? It's really nice anyway. It's really gold and really, really Christmassy. It's, it's really nice. So I have that. I already have a table cover. So I wasn't gonna get a table cover, but I thought actually it'll look really nice if I buy the whole set. Plus if it's not big enough, I can just use the other table cover and then the table runner and place like, place mats that I bought will still match the other table cover so I've got like two table covers and then the runner and mats will match both of them so and we also have a smaller table which we normally put out with like buffet on so we might just use that or I don't know so I might need two table covers I don't know but now I have two so I've got the gold one and then the same pattern but red um I got the table runner so it's really sparkly but it's not coming across on camera at all. It doesn't look sparkly at all, really. But anyway, so I got the red table runner to go along the center of like the gold. And then I got these table placemats. Um, I don't know how fussed I was on them being like, why isn't it focusing on me? I don't know how fussed I was on them being like rectangle, but I feel like on top of the gold with the runner, they'll all match really nicely. So yeah, anyway, so they were four pound for four. So I had to get two because there's going to be six of us or at least five of us if his brother doesn't manage to come for dinner. But he's still going to like come over. So he still needs like a place. I think this was maybe four as well. And then I think this was four. I think they were all around four pound. Uh, let's have a look. So the tablecloth was four ninety nine, The runner was two ninety nine, and the placemats were three ninety nine. So £16 for a six person um like table cover runner and place mats i think is quite good and it's red and gold and it's all sparkly so i'm very much looking forward to putting that on my table on christmas so like i said i went in for the table sorry the chair covers and they didn't have them so i still need to get another two of them and they're two for 249 so i need to get another two four yeah so that's like a fiver yeah so and then i have a spare tablecloth now so all I need to get now is I have a knife and fork holder for me and Matthew from last year. Matthew has a snowman and I have a reindeer. So I need to get another four of those, but I got them on eBay. Um, I need to get some more confetti for the table. There's just a few more things. I, I really just want to make it like amazing. Like this is the first year I'm going to be hosting Christmas dinner. And I know I'm on a budget, so I can't do it as well as I would like. And I was looking and they had like gold champagne flutes and everything. And I was like, I just can't afford it, but... You know, I've, I've kind of gone out of my way a little bit and got like this whole table set thing, which I wasn't particularly going to do. But I do remember that last year we didn't have placemats and it was a bit, I don't know, I would like placemats. So I've got us placemats. I've got us a runner, which I wanted last year, but we only had a small table. And then I've got an extra table cover just because it was, how much was the table cover? So the, the tablecloth was 4 99 it was the most expensive thing. I didn't actually really need it. But just in case, I have a spare table cover in case something spills or anything. So I'll show you what else I got anyway. So I think I showed you that they had um, Descendants dolls. And they had Evie with three outfits for 9 99 And I was like, I really want that. Like, I can't even tell you how bad I want it. But I need to be good. Like, I've got people coming over. I still haven't sh like started Matthew's Christmas shopping. Everybody else's Christmas shopping is pretty much done. But um, I haven't even started Matthews. I know when I'm getting them, kind of. But I just haven't had a chance to go get it yet. And that's not like me. Normally, I already have loads of stuff for Matthew. But I'm just a bit skint this year, aren't we all? So now um, I always get my Batiste in Home Bargains. And they have, like, small ones for 149 
and now they have normal size for 189 and large ones for 249 that's how much they are in boots and superdrug when they're like on offer once in the blue moon so large batiste 249 in home bargains i am very happy about that i finally got my candle you know how last week was it the first or the second of vlogmas i was looking for this candle and I've got it. They've got it back in stock. There was only a few left. So I've got my candle. I'm going to burn that. I'm very excited. I can't wait. And me and Matthew, again, when we we're in home bargains the other day, how bright is this camera? Honestly, I don't know what's up with the lighting in here, but um, when me and Matthew were in home bargains the other day, we were looking at lights and then we didn't end up getting any just because there was no suction cups and stuff. And it was just going to be a faff and we don't have ladders. So then I was like, you know what? I think I'd like some to put in the window because then you can still see them from the outside but they're still like show a bit of festiveness. So anyway, these were like, how much were these? Like two, three pounds. So the 24 suction hooks was 99 pence. They only had the giant ones in last time. So that kind of stopped us getting any. And then snowflake icicle stars. So these were 3.99 and they are indoor only. Um, but I really wanted them to put around the, ki the kitchen window. Oh, look. And yes, I got multicolored because you guys know what I'm like and I love a bit of color. So I'm going to put these around the kitchen window um, now. Like, well, let's do it now. Put them around the kitchen window and Matthew gets in from work. He'll be like, what? Because like, I do want to put lights up outside, but I feel like I want to invest in some really nice ones and would have to get ladders and spend like a good couple of hours like putting them up and stuff. And every year I really want some and we never get any just because they're expensive and it's just something that we could be spending on something else around Christmas. Yeah, these were 3 99 and they can go in the kitchen window so you can still see them from like outside. And then I can still see them kind of like from through the blind that's in the kitchen. And then when people come over on Christmas, it's all Christmassy and I don't know. This is still technically the front of the house, it's just inside. And there were 3 dollars which is quite a massive difference from buying outdoor ones. So yeah, the rabbit is staring at me like, what are you doing? I want a mother. Are you gorgeous? He knows he's gorgeous. All right, I'm gonna put these lights up. So let's go and do that now. Is that everything I bought? Apart from the suction cups? Yeah, that's everything I bought. Also, what was really weird when I was coming out of Home Bargains, there was this man and he kind of like, you know when you can tell someone deliberately walks a certain way because you're walking that way? And he kind of walked up behind me and I was very aware that I had my camera over my shoulder. It was so busy in there, by the way. Like, I apologise, I didn't record very much. And then I had a very heavy basket. Like, all this was in a basket, like a candle, big thing of toilet roll, all these like place things. Anyway, so I was carrying this stuff to the car and then he was kind of like right behind us and he started talking to us and he was like, it's really busy, isn't it? And I was like, yeah, it's really busy. And I was a bit kind of like, I know you walked this way because I was walking this way. Like I seen you look at us and then change your direction. So I was very aware and I was like, is he after my camera? Like, it's quite a safe area where I live, but I'm just always having my wits about me with stuff like that because like, but my problem was that I had a 600 pound camera on my shoulder and my brand new phone in my pocket. And I was just like, please don't steal my stuff. Like, I can't afford to replace this phone. I can't afford to replace this camera. So I was just like, yeah, mm -hmm, yeah, it's really busy. You're like trying to be nice, but at the same time trying to be like, I'm a woman on my own, it's dark, please go away. I was walking to the car and I was, and, and he kind of like reared towards my car as well. And I was like, you can't be walking this way because this is, this is my car and there's no, like no more cars around here. And then I was like, have a nice Christmas. Like I was nice. I was like, Merry Christmas. I do like saying Merry Christmas to people. So I was like, Merry Christmas, have a nice Christmas. And he went, oh, okay. And then kind of like realized that I was going to my car and then walked the other way. And then I started opening the car and putting the stuff in. And then he was just kind of stood there staring at us. And I looked at him and he, he'd had his hood up at this point. And I was like, oh my God. And he was like, Merry Christmas. And I was like, Merry Christmas. And then he was like, I'm Santa Claus. And I was like, what? And he did have a full white beard. Hence why I wasn't too worried at this point and I was being friendly because he did look like Santa Claus and he put his hood up and it was a red hood and he was like, I'm Santa Claus and I was like, oh, okay, Merry Christmas and he was like, Merry Christmas and then walked off and I was like, what was that about? Like, that was really weird. Like, if he was generally just being a nice man, it was, it was very nice of him to walk me towards my car and just be polite, but it was just a bit scary when you're on your own and you seen him kind of walk in your direction and then he put his hood up but anyway i just thought i'd share that with you it was really weird so i'm gonna put these lights up and then we're gonna go upstairs and film because it's half four and i still haven't filmed and also this makeup's probably fallen off our face at this point so i'm going to 
get these lights up, which I know I should be filming, but I really want to get them up. And then we will film. So let us quickly go and get these lights up. So I've got the lights out of the box and there is a lot more than I thought for our little kitchen window. So these are the hooks. So I think what the best thing for me to do is, is just like wrap them like, so this was the corner of the window, like up and around the whole window and just cover the whole window. It might be a bit excessive, but it's like, at least it gets them used. Like I paid for them now, I've opened them. Um, I think they're nicer than just putting up some like string kind of fairy lights, which I have like all over the house on a daily, yearly basis anyway. Um, like I've got them above my bed. There's actually some already around the kitchen window. Um, like on the inside so like these are a little bit more Christmassy effort than just fairy lights so I'm gonna try and wrap them around and around the window this was completely unplanned by the way it's just because I'm so desperate that was a postman it's just because I'm so desperate to have some it's just because I'm so desperate to have some outdoor lights and every time I go into shops at Christmas time and they have like outdoor lights I'm desperate for some and then we just never end up getting them because we just we just can't afford them we don't have time to put them up um so yeah i'm i just had to get these like it had to happen like i was staring at them and we didn't get any last time because we couldn't get the hooks which was just going to mean that they just never end up getting put up so i seen the hooks and i was like right i'm getting some the 3.99 and the they, they say christmas to me they're a bit more effort than your usual fairy light and you can see them from the outside of the house without actually having to hang any lights outside the house, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna try and hang around, hang around, hang these around the window now. <laughs> Yay, I've done it. How cute does that look? Those little suction things are so cool. The only thing I would say is, is that I wish there were one more row longer because I feel like it needs another row here. Um, yeah, like, I don't know whether to try and space them out a tiny bit more, like just bring them down a tiny bit more, just because there's quite a gap there, or whether to just leave it. I kind of want to go out the front and see what it looks like. Um, yeah, I think I'm going to try and space them out a tiny little bit, and then I'm going to go and have a look out the front. <laughs> oh, that was so cold. I just ran out to see what they looked like. I spaced them out a little bit. Um, yeah, they look fine. Like, I'm happy with them. They actually do fit perfectly now that I've spaced them out properly. Oh, sorry, my hair's annoying me. The wind just blew it all over the place. It was freezing. I ran outside without a coat on or shoes. But yeah, I'm really happy for 3 99 I am spreading the Christmas joy. Can't wait for Matthew to pull on the drive and see them. I know his face. He's just going to be like... <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to go and set up now because I really, really need to start recording. I know I'm supposed to be recording, but these just came in the post and I ordered them to hang our stockings on. So they only had black available. I would have liked red or green, you know, Christmassy. But never mind, um, they kind of go with the stockings. So I've hung our stockings on. So this one's Matthews. This one's the Boons. Which one of you guys sent me? Um, Helga or Heidi? Heidi, I want to say. It was really hard for me to read the name on the card, but I did um, unbox it in a weekly, last weekly vlog. So thank you for that. That's now the Buns stocking. We did have like a proper big one for him that used to be my one I explained in yesterday's Vlogmas. But I think this one's cuter. So this one's the buns and then this one's mine. I'll be honest, they're not the best place to hang stockings. Like they look okay, but if they had a fireplace behind them, they'd hang better like that one keeps turning. But you've got to work with what you've got. Maybe one day I'll have a big proper fireplace and a dining room and all that. But for now, I'm quite happy with this. Oh my goodness, I'm very tired now. I'm also very aware that this vlog is probably quite boring because I'm just kind of sitting around filming. But I just realised that the last time I spoke to you, I was like, I'm going to go and film. And then that was quite a few hours ago. Like, if you can see Cogsworth there, it's now 8 o'clock. So I ended up having to sit down because I was knackered. Like, so much more than I should have been. Well, not than I should have been, but basically. I think editing the Vlogmas and then getting ready when you have ME. Or for anyone, I suppose. But when you have ME, getting ready is like quite an effort like it really takes it out of you like I remember when I was younger and I used to get ready to go out to like I don't know like drinks or like a meal and stuff and it's like I used to be knackered before I used to get to the meal and everybody else used to be like oh the best part of going out is like getting ready and it's like for me it's just really tiring to do this like it, it just is so anyway I did this in like to get ready for the YouTube videos apart from the lipstick 
Then I made some bracelets and got them all packaged up and did a few emails. Then by the time I got to the post office and then walked around the shops and then got home, I was absolutely knackered. And then I put those lights up as well, like, ugh. Anyway, so yeah, I um, I ended up sitting for about an hour after I spoke to you on the sofa with a cup of tea with my advent calendar, advent calendar, advent calendar chocolate and just chilling because I was that knackered. I was like, I'm so tired and I need to film. Like I need to film. Like I don't need to, but I really want to film. So yeah, I ended up doing that. And then my sister texts me and she's given me a couple of products for a store that she runs. And she was like, I really need you to take these photos um, to put on my website to sell these. So I was like, oh, like I'd said that I would do them for her. But it's like I've got my own stuff to do Amy but anyway so I had to go and take some product photos for my sister so it was literally like as fast as I could do them sort of thing because it was like clothes and that really took it out of me so then I finally came down got everything for the Disney haul like the stuff around me now is crazy like if you haven't seen the Disney haul already go and see it and if it's not up yet then see it when it's up and then by the time I got the lights and like sorted out the plugs and everything for this room and then recorded it I'm absolutely knackered like my back is killing eight o'clock and I've got one video recorded I don't understand like I got ready at a decent time and I've got one video recorded like why does this always happen I feel very weak as well because I'm very hungry so I think I'm gonna have to order a takeaway which I don't really want to do but I don't know what else to do I'll see how I feel like if my takeaway takes like 20 minutes I'll eat it and then if I feel like a bit more energetic I'll record the next video yeah I'm gonna have to just call it a night but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave this room set up to film and then I'm just gonna like film tomorrow which I don't really know what I was planning on doing tomorrow. Like, I still really need to do bracelet stuff. Like, I can't even tell you how bad I need to do bracelet stuff. It's so bad. By the way, though, this candle, it fills the house. It smells so good and it fills the house. Like, I have the Halloween one from Home Bargains. And I remember there was a Halloween one from Home Bargains a couple of years ago that smelled so good and filled the house. And I've kept it and it's still in the garage because I don't want to burn it because it smells so good. And every year I buy the new Halloween one from Home Bargains and it does not smell anywhere near as strong. So I got this one thinking it'll smell good but it won't really fill the house. And oh my god, I was upstairs and I could smell it wafting up the stairs. It's amazing. Get this gingerbread candle from Whole Bargains. It's amazing. Like, I'm going to have to get another one. Anyway, I'm going to go and order a takeaway and lie down. I'm desperate for a wee. Right, I'll catch you guys in a bit. I've decided. As much as I don't want to waste this makeup, <laughs> I can't film another video. Like, I went upstairs and I ordered a takeaway on my phone. Then I came down and I've put some potatoes in the oven for Matthew because he's just going to have potato and beans, which I pretty much have that every day for my lunch, so I don't really want it again. I mean, to be honest, all I'm ordering is a chip buddy from the takeaway, but like, I just kind of want some takeaway chips. Not very healthy, but I don't do it very often. I kind of really want a bath, but if I wash my hair again, and it's annoying as well because it's like, I have to wear a wig tomorrow because it needs dyed so bad. Like, if I wash it, like, oh. Why don't I just have energy to record more videos? Like, ever since the EMP London event, I don't know what it was about that event, but it messed up my sleeping pattern really bad, and now I'm not sleeping till like two in the morning, and I'm getting up at like 10 o'clock most days, which is just not good, is it? It's not very good, so yeah. This candle smells so good, I can smell it all the time. I'll get back to you guys in a bit. I literally do not know where the day has gone from me today, like, I know I didn't wake up till 10, which I hate. And Matthew said he did wake me up this morning, but I, I don't really remember. So I um, had my dinner and I've come up to bed. It's like, it's 10 to 10. Like, where's the day gone? Like, I don't even know how much like footage I've shot today, but I hope, I hope it's enough for a vlog. But yeah, um, I'm going to get to bed now. I probably won't get to sleep for hours because I want to get up early and record a load of videos tomorrow again. <laughs> And I still need to do loads of bracelet stuff. So I'm going to get to bed. But I hope this vlogmas wasn't too boring. I hope it was okay. And yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.